Two key terms come to mind as I try to put my Israel experience into perspective, connection and identity. After visiting and attending services in different synagogues in Prague and Poland, I felt a strengthened connection to my Jewish roots and Jewish tradition. It was really fascinating to see how Jewish people lived in Eastern Europe and how so much has changed within the Jewish culture. The connection that I had to my classmates while attending the Jewish Academy was drastically changed while traveling with them for six weeks. It was our time in Israel that had the most dramatic influence on our relationships with each other. I feel that our class as a whole has gotten a lot closer after this trip. These connections were born through the many late night discussions about religion, our individual connection to Israel, and about what lies ahead of us in our future. Our late night discussions in Prague and Poland transpired into incredible experiences in Eretz Yisrael. For example, our first memorable Shabbat in Jerusalem. The women and men were separated, but each group joined together with, with yeshiva students who showed us a new way to embrace prayer through song and dance. It was a very unique experience at the Kotel, as it was my, many of my classmates' first time at the wall. Even for those of us who had been there before, it was very special, as we shared this experience with students from all over the world. We later discussed how not only was it our first Shabbat in Israel, a religious eye-opening experience. It was also a clear symbol of the commitment of our generation to continue the Jewish traditions that have been passed down from generation to generation. The second concept that comes to mind is identity. One constant theme that I noticed was the will to survive. After learning about what the Jewish people of Eastern Europe went through to preserve and maintain their identity, it made me proud to visit Eretz Israel, a nation that continues to preserve Jewish identity and tradition. It is with much importance that I note how critical the relationship between the diaspora Jews and the people of Israel is. This relationship is one of interdependence, in that we, as Jews living outside of Israel, need to support those Jews living in Israel as they defend and protect the Jewish state. They, in turn, serve for us, the Jews of the diaspora, as a constant symbol of our Jewish identity and sense of belonging. During our trip, I was able to experience firsthand what our sister city in Israel struggles with on a daily basis in order to ensure its security. During the four days that we spent in the homes of the families of Shar HaNegev, we felt very safe and were very fascinated in the way that they lived their daily lives. The morning that we left Shar HaNegev, the Seva Adom siren went off and people rushed to bomb shelters. When the siren was over, the families we were staying with dropped us off to rejoin with our group and they, then they returned home to continue with their daily life. After the alarm, we went, we learned what it was like to live like true Israelis. We moved on with the rest of our day and continued our tours. Over the years, this San Diego has enjoyed an incredible, a cl incredibly close relationship with Shar HaNegev, and more specifically, the San Diego Jewish Academy has engaged in programming with the high school of the region. We will always know that there is a place in the homes and hearts of the families of Shar HaNegev. This trip contextualized my years of Jewish education at the San Diego Jewish Academy in relation to our rich and diverse heritage and history. It also made me realize the importance of Jewish advocacy. I now feel more prepared to stand up for and defend Israel's existence and struggle for survival at any given moment during my upcoming college experience. We, the class of 2007, would like to thank SCJA for affording us this amazing opportunity to strengthen our Jewish identity and our relationship with Eretz Yisrael. This profound experience will continue to define who I am as I progress along my Jewish path of life. Thank you.